iOS app will advance here. To demonstrate how to download GBA for iOS back again on your iOS 10 device or lower. Remember, guys, if you want to enjoy the video, don't forget to drop a thumbs up down below. If you haven't subscribed, turn on notifications so you don't miss out videos like this. Go on this one right now, and let's begin with today's tutorial. Now, first off, you guys know I just made a, another vi a video on like GBA for iOS like two days ago, and sadly, it was revoked. But this is an updated tutorial to that tutorial, because guess what, guys? You know, I don't stop, you know, with GB Fry West. You guys know I want to get you guys the GB Fry West emulator as soon as I can. So all I ask for you guys is just one like on this video, okay? If you're signing to your YouTube account, just, just drop a like on this video, because guess what? I put a lot of work into actually researching and finding these videos, but now lately I don't actually edit my videos and stuff like that, which does make it a lot easier on me, but at the same time, you know, I start I do miss editing, but um, you know, my new editor, he he makes some really nice thumbnails. I mean, I mean, if you haven't seen like how nice my thumbnails have been, that's why because I you know have someone who actually makes my videos and stuff like that now, um, which is in the end pretty awesome. You know, I can't I can't complain, but um, you know, he's always also you know my editor is also helping me like trying to find these methods because um, you know he's he's always hyped and I'm really hyped right now because you know I found you guys another method. So that's why I'll ask you guys is just. You know, if you're signed into your YouTube account, just sign, just drop a like on this video because every like counts in the end. It makes me just want to make another video on GB Fry West or any method that you guys really want to see. But you know, there's a couple methods that have not been able to really make it on my channel, and that is because you know it just hasn't been coming back. There are no methods for it, especially like NDS for iOS. There are no methods out there for NDS for iOS right now. It's crazy. It's literally gone off the grid, and I'm looking always for you guys. But turns out GB for iOS just keeps on coming back to me but anyways guys enough of my rambling let's begin with today's tutorial so head over to the link in the description below and i'll take you to the site right here brett go ahead and press install then from here it should redirect you to your settings application go ahead and press install put in the password that belongs to your phone click install one more time then it'll say installing profile and once you actually do that it'll redirect you to safari and then i will redirect you back to settings application and you want to do the same process again download it one more time okay press install and then click it done now now once you go back to your home screen, Zestia should be installed. So go ahead and click on that and it'll say configuring, let it load up how it is, and at the top it'll say home and packages. Go ahead and click on packages, go to all applications. From here you want to scroll down so you can find GB for iOS. Go ahead and tap here to install. And once you actually click tap here to install, it'll create a prompt asking you, would you like to install GB for iOS? Go ahead and press install. And yeah, so if you are tuned into my channel and you have my notifications turned on, you'll already know that I just made a video on this and basically two Two days ago and so you're like why are you making another video on this well because i don't i don't know if i explained this in the beginning of the video it was revoked and now it's back again with a different certificate so it's pretty amazing this app i mean that's why i keep re recommend you guys to keep this app on your phone because once in time time and time again it's showing us that you know gb for ios is not going down so easy with this app i mean it's pretty awesome but remember guys don't forget to turn on my notifications as you'll you know if this video does not work for you next time i make another video on gb for ios you'll be like one of the first people alerted but basically once you install it all the way you'll click on it it's gonna say untrusted enterprise developer go ahead and press cancel head over to settings go down to general scroll down all the way till you can find profiles device management once you find profiles device management you want to find a certificate certificate app that actually belongs to gb for ios which is this one right here go to press trust go to press trust one more time and there you go you have access to gb for ios back again on our ios 10 device or lower remember guys don't forget to subscribe don't forget to drop a thumbs up on this video this has been Apple Advance, and see you guys.